This protocol is significant because it allows us to study the function of proteins, such as extracellular matrix proteins, that are upregulated in later stages of myotube formation or maturation. This method can be used to knock down any gene of interest in C2C12 cells by using specific hHRNAs and the respective analytical tools for phenotyping. The main advantage of this method is that we have generated C2C12 cells that can continuously suppress our genes of interest, even in mature myotubes. The most important aspect of this procedure is to maintain C2C12 cells in the undifferentiated state which means at a low cell density during routine cell culture. The day before transfection, seed 5 times 10 to the 4th C2C12 cells per milliliter in 2 milliliters of complete DMEM per well in a 6-well plate to achieve a 40 to 50% confluence after overnight incubation at 37 degrees Celsius and 5% CO2. The next morning, combine 100 microliters of 25 millimolar sodium chloride in one 1.5 milliliter reaction tube per culture well with 25.5 microliters PEI stock solution of an undifferentiated C2C12 cell culture for a 5-minute incubation at 37 degrees Celsius. Next, combine 3 micrograms of plasma DNA with 100 microliters of 25 millimolar sodium chloride per culture well for a 5-minute incubation at 37 degrees Celsius. At the end of the incubations, combine the entire volume of each diluted PEI reagent with each diluted plasma.